audio. Not sure what Ooh, is. more. Is it a. I know, it's some kind of. What is this? I don't even know. It would be great to get. Oh, this is an amazing find. This is Ooh. something really unusual. And I wish in. I had my computer here with my notes. This is in the same family as the jelly nose eels. It's a teleopodidae. And I think the genus on this. Oh, gosh. I, can't remember. This is something I think was, that was described from Japan with the spots, and it recently was found over in Indonesia from ROV work. The pelvic fins are modified into those uh, long free rays with spoon-shaped ends, so very distinctive. Probably use those to feel along on the bottom. It's got a body that's shaped like a rat tail, but it's stockier. A single dorsal fin that's short, and I wish for the life of me I could remember what this is, but this is definitely the first record of this genus of fish from the Marianas. It's, I think it's only known from off Japan and from Indonesia. Uh, this is, this is a, an extremely unusual find. Bruce, I absolutely love that we have stumped you for once, because you have never been stumped before. So pilots, if we could just hold here for a bit, getting a bit more footage. As Bruce said, this is a new record for the Marianas region. Okay, I've got a species identification for this. Um, it's, um, I'm, I don't, I'm not on the chat room, but the genus is Guntherius, G-U-E-N-T-H-E-R-U-S. And the species is Katoi, K-A-T-O-I. It was described as a new species in uh, 2008. Uh, the people that found this over in Indonesia were doing ROV surveys in the same habitat, the same depth that the Indonesian coelacanth was found in. Oh. And it was a, a, an extremely unusual find there. So you've got something really, really interesting here. He's not very shy, is he? And despite what you said before about uh, not stumping me and everything, I'm often wrong about uh, things. I'm certain about this one. The thing that I'm thinking is that this may be a record for this entire family that's new for the Marianas. I don't know if this family, unless you've seen jelly nose eels on the deeper dives on this expedition, could be a new record for an entire family from the Marianas. And so, Bruce, what, what, is, what are the modified fins on the underside of it for? Are they sensory? They're probably sensory, probably for sensoring food. But, I mean, this species was described in 2006. So it's, it's barely even oh, known wow. taxonomically, so there's nothing known about its biology. Wow, this is incredible, then. Oop, 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 oop. I finally decided he had had enough. Oh. Now, is he going to walk on those little tiny modified fins again? No, I think Bruce was just saying it's sensory. Oh, they're sensory. What's he doing? He's a little blind. Trying to hide in plain sight? Yeah. What a beautiful fish. Pilot, do you see the thing yeah, maybe stunned by the bright lights and all. Um, again, uh, all the speculations about the function of some of these fins and all. Um, you have like the second observation of a live one of these, aside from the ROV work done in Indonesia. So this is all brand new. You know, we know almost nothing about this species. And so you're getting uh, new information second by second here. Wow. Uh, come on. 